Hello there again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. I thought, well, we've, we've customized the one of the uncustomized Eudoras. Why don't we do the other one? Why not? Why not, I say? It's not a pink Cadillac. It's kind of more of a pink Oldsmobile kind of thing. But let's, let's try again. I want to do this one completely high-end but wild. Let's do secondary arch covers because we're going to mix up the colors. Armor it up. Brakes, of course. Bumpers. Frumper. Do we want to go secondaries on this? Just for a wild uh, repaint. Secondary classic. Which one do we like? The more blocky classic or the... I kind of like the curvier one. We haven't done a lowrider vampire bumper in a while. These may go back to being chrome. You never know. Rear bumpers. Ooh, we haven't thrown the. We haven't thrown the spare on any of these. Let's let's chrome out the front and then we'll we'll put the vintage. Let's vintage this up. With the spare. Front bumpers. Yeah, we're gonna go. Chrome Lowrider. You don't have like a vintage, it's not gonna match. So we got that matched with that. That's some heavy duty wildness. Okay. It's gonna take away from our color options a little bit, and then I guess that really means we have to go with a chrome arch cover, really, to match it up for chrome in it again. Getting all chromey here. Although, or do we? We have some chrome there. We could do color. We could do different color. Let's, let's hold on to that as a thought. Bumpers were done. Engine. It needs a better engine. Chrome tip exhausts. I think double side exhausts on this one. We don't want to go with the shorties. This one we want to enhance the length. Primary stock grill. Stock grill, primary stock grill. Enhance the front color. The secondary aggressive grill, which we can do. let's do that. Secondary aggressive. This will only make sense once we're, we're painting the thing. Not a lot of variations on the hood. Secondary center trim molding. Let's try that. Again, all will make sense in a little bit. Horn. Ooh, what do we want to do here? I think we need one of the loops. Let's do the San Andreas loop. We'll, we'll hold off on the lights until after we figure out the delivery. So you got your basic pinstripe, thick white striping here, outline white striping, red flame, elaborate orange pinstripe, bois, and then some extra bois. All right, do we already did the cab? I didn't think. I thought I'd do that first. I think we're gonna have to go to Respray on this. Metallic. Okay, that makes the whole hood. I thought it would just be the inset. Would be, um... Hmm. Okay, let, let me back out of that for a second. Let's treat the primary like it's the secondary. You know what I'm saying? Let's build it up that way. Where are the purples? Yeah, midnight purple. Okay. And let's see. Oh, that's right. We have to throw the uh, the pearlescent on for the primary. So now, what works with that purple? Bluish silver, shadow silver. I mean, this doesn't look particularly wild, Vince. Yes, I know. We're working on it. Let's 
guess it's got like a white pearlescent, so it's not really popping it. Fister pink. Candy red. The only thing that goes with it, you, you could do the dew yellow thing. I think we might need a brighter purple. This is turning into old man car in a real hurry. And this not the I think hot pink. I think we need a, some hot pink element here. As you can see, now from the pearlescent, also hot pink, it's picking up a little bit. Do we want to go with a, a, a brighter pink? That doesn't seem to be as effective as the hot. Trim color, we need to brighten this up. There you go. Yeah, that dark purple's not working. Secondary metallic what? Spinnaker? Bleached brown. I feel like white's too much of a cop out. Oh, kind of a pink and white thing. You need to you need to have these things play off each other a little bit. So I'm kind of like just a bright purple. And since we're getting the wildness from that, can we get something different instead of the pink? Because that's just a little too much. What other options we got to work with the purple? I mean, white does work with it. Lime green, woodward, that's too jokery. What if we just did ice white and purple? Very U of S. With a pearlescent, and then we do, let's go for like a pearlescent midnight purple here, or a pearlescent bright purple. To give everything a, a brighter coat. Or a purple, hey, go back to the hot pink. Or, you know what really goes hot off of this? Where's the, where's my blues? Came in this without a plan at all. Okay, the ultra blue works well off that. And now you gotta think, well, hmm. Secondary, what if we match it? What if we forget the two tone? Okay, let's just forget the two tone for a minute. Or at least let's work through it in a different way. Like the black works as a two tone. That pink, the, the salmon pink, works as a two tone. I think you almost do need a little bit darker purple, don't you think? And you're back to pink and purple. I don't know. The yellow, that's also be very U of S. But in a more expressive way, do yellow. If we reverse them. Like if we do this, bright purple on the top. Do yellow on the bottom. Trim color. I don't know about black, but midnight purple. So midnight purple there. Bounce out of respray. Primary color, metallic. I 
work. That actually kind of does work. Just get rid of the whole purple idea. Just go black and... Not as wild as I wanted it to be, though. That's what bright purple. Midnight purple is almost black again, but maybe, maybe... No, right, let's do that. With a pearlescent bright purple. That's probably what we want. You do, what happens if we go like a hot pink? Looks a little weird on the green, but I think it does bring out the purple a lot better. Hey, you're not gonna notice the the pink the pinkness on the green as much. So let's let's work on parts now. Do we want the hood to be that green? That looks better, does it not? Grill. Do we want to go primary? Primary aggressive. I think that that works a little bit better too. It breaks up the green a little bit. Let's go back up to arch covers. Go primary on the arch covers. Armor is good. Now we have to. We've lost track of everything. Uh, yeah, we definitely want to keep the rest of that. That's good. Grill good. Hood good. Hood good. Lights. Neon kit. Neon layout. Front back sides. Neon color. Purple or black light. Which is the. This is the warmer one. So we're gonna go with that. And it is, a, it is a Joker build now, unfortunately, but livery, though, we can dress this up a little bit. Basic pinstripe, white stripes, red stripes, that's... That does dress it up, but it is a bit of a, hmm... This makes me think. A lab. If we go with, oh, let's we'll look at the other ones. See, this will be. This would be good if we went. If we change this to a blue. We could do either a blue. I think what we're gonna do here. Now, follow me on this. Go back to respray. Oh uh, yeah, mirrors. Let's go with the squared mirrors just to respray the secondary. Now, what if we brought that up to a bright orange? Ooh, I see it's the, it's the same kind of contrast, but with a little bit more brightness. It's the bright orange, not the regular orange. We still have the pink, the trim color. We need to we need to bring this up a little bit. Bleach brown. I think with a light smoke that'll work out. Roof, secondary roof. Do we want that? No, we don't. I think, you know, roof accessories, we're going to put... This. Do we have surfboards on this? We do. Let's do a surfboard build on this one. Kind of a plain surfboard, but it is what it is, and it does, doesn't clash. You need that for the... Um, for the handling, actually. Suspension, slam in the ground, transmission, trim, stock trim, chrome lower trim, primary, primary trim plate, does that does work. Does so that mean we should go with the secondary? 
recovers though, or does that just keep the flow going? I think that just keeps the flow going. Turbo, obviously. Wheels, wheel type high end. Chrome wet rims here. We're gonna. Diamonds. Diamonds are a car's best friend, right? Super G. This is all just what do you think it looks? What's the best look here? I'm thinking the diamonds. Expensive, yeah, but. I, mean, beats, I was going to put chrome mercenaries on it otherwise, and like, that's just like what I normally do. Put the economy tires on it, bulletproof them, tire smoke, throw it the purple, whenever that transaction pins. Windows, light smoke it. Is this one that needs a limo look? Maybe. Maybe this one needs a little limo dark. Now we'll exit. That looks pretty funky. That's ready for the car show and not much else. Should we take it up to Iliad? I do it all the way up. I can just say play jobs, my jobs, races, the Shiliad hot lap route. I mean, I've already taken a Eudora up here, but this one's lowered with high end wheels. It's got the surfboard. It looks funky. This will be visually interesting. Time of day, noon, weather clear. Customs are on, make it a GTA in case I have to boop it out of there because I'm not going to follow the, the rules of G Fred anyway. This isn't even, this is becoming less of a G Fred thing because the hot lap route is no longer the preferred. It's not as hot. There's the new hot lap. There she is. Got that, got that. Slammed in the weeds. Might as well get those things while we're here. Look at the sunlight, man. That's about what I was looking for. And you know, purple, orange, it's in the, the color scheme of oh, that rear, the huge rear end. I wonder if that will hurt us somewhere down the road. Okay, we kind of skipped this thing like a skipping stone across the water. The train is going to be coming. Got to get this thing on the tracks. Get all that downforce from that surfboard. We're going to surf off the top of Mount Chilia. That's what the plan is. Yeah, I know it's been done, but this is this is kind of. I wonder how much longer I'm going to keep doing this. How much? How many more can I go up to the ad videos will I do? Because you know you don't want to get too repetitive either. I mean, this does look funky. And it doesn't look like it doesn't look like this is going to go well. This is not a chili ad ascent car. This is more of a test of how is this car going to look absolutely destroyed. That's what I sense. And to be perfectly honest, I don't even remember exactly how the other one went, so... I'm guessing not well.
Okay, let's work as much momentum as we can here. You watch me, I put all the turbos on and everything, right? Let's try and take this at a good place. Come on, pull, go down a gear. You need another gear. Come on, baby. Alright, the power wheelie was almost working, but it took us off course. Ah. That was a powerful wheelie, though. I know it's the wrong way. Oh, it's power wheeling with spinning us out. Ah. Alright, so we can't do it. We didn't think we could do it. It was a matter of, hey, let's prove the fact that we can't do it. Wow, exploded off a tree! Okay, we need to consider perhaps another way of doing this. And I don't know the new route very really well at all. It's, we can give it a shot. I'm trying to remember. I remember it's, it's, you have to follow this road for a little while and then turn up. I don't remember where. Oh, this road here? Maybe? No, this isn't it. But is it a way? Can we find a way? Is there a way? No, we're just finding our way back to the original. Well, no. Maybe this will this will loop us up here into where we can eventually turn onto a track. This isn't even the right mountain, is it? Nope. Not the right mountain yet. Come on back down. You don't even know what mountain you're on! We're gonna explode, aren't we? We hit with our own fender. Okay. We've lightened that end of the car up for better handling. I'm not sure that would actually improve handling. In any way, shape, or form. Okay, so are we at least we're getting to the right mountain. We're getting to the right mountain. I'm looking for a place that looks like it would be convenient to go up. Certainly not there. Maybe here? It depends on how this is coated. Is it like okay dirt or slippery dirt? And once again, is it the right mountain? I don't know. Oh, how do we get airborne in there? No, 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 no. Not airborne.
But we, we're, we're on slippery ground now. It was going so well. Brakes, come on, cut across, cut across back. Will we survive this? Okay, wait, 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 wait a minute. Here we are, I'm one of these ravines. Okay, so it won't wheelie with its... <sighs> Again, not G-Fred legal, but... I wasn't trying to turn, I was trying to just drive it up the with uh, Drive it up the slot here. I'm going forward. Not that you'd notice. If you can get over this little lip, I think we can build up some momentum. This isn't working. Hate to do that, but I think we're gonna go my my usual alternate way here because I don't want to take all day on this. Like, really? Seriously? We're gonna get up this car. With this car. We may die repeatedly. Now, I have my own way up to the ad. Or if this doesn't work, so much for all that limo smoke. But at least it's breezy. And you've seen me do this before, but if you go out of the main town, instead of taking the Gruffy route up the hill, if you take a left, there's a bunch of trails. It tells you the wrong way for a little bit, but it's it's not wrong. 
Uh, it's, again, I think you've seen me take this route well more than once. This is tricky because you got a long car and these are a little tight. But the way the game is programmed, while you're on the trail, you're still on some kind of road. I mean, it should still be considered off-road, I know, but it's not as bad as, you know, going up the side of Tilly. Right? You don't want to necessarily start on it, though, so let's just keep the hammer down here and keep the tires spinning and keep it moving. Momentum, that is our friend. Keep this a little wide so I can, oh dear, not do that. Come on, ya, ya land ya. Let's push ya up this hill. We have surfing to do. I know that makes no sense. I don't really need it to make any sense, though. I took the tail out. It wasn't too bad a place, though. Come on. Come on, baby. We can do this. You've got to carry enough speed to keep going without yeeting it off the cliff. Because the cliff is right there and it wants you to eat. Whoa! What the heck happened there? Backwards. Why did it, why did it do that kind of eat? Okay, I have to go down a little bit. Turn this around, we're all going off the cliff. There you go. Come on. Aren't you glad engine wear isn't a thing in these? Like, I would have blown the engine a while ago on this. Come on! We're almost there. Tantalizing, isn't it? Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to line up on this. A little bit shallow. Oh, that, that didn't work at all. The wheelie thing did not go. Yay, we got the checkpoint. Now gravity is our friend big, we're heavy, we're prone to explode. It's going to be great. Okay, that, that's... I am on the brakes with these with this thing. And let's see. Brakes. And steering. Off the brakes a little bit. Try to eat it towards the, the left. More towards the left. We need more left. We needed more left. Ow. Please don't explode. We're almost there. Reverse. Little J turn action. Almost lost it into the train, but we're here. Told you. And there's definitely some surfing going on there, so I think I lived up to that. So we're a little worse for wear. Not too bad, though, really. 
We didn't lose our surfboard. Just cruising along the, the railroad tracks. Okay, that's that's what happens when you're not looking. We get bent up a little bit more. That's why you don't drive sideways, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! That's one way to dismount. I've never done a, a left side dismount on this before. Get you where you need to be. None the worse for wear. Yeah, you think the grill would have been better orange? I don't know. Kind of like a tongue sticking out of your bed. Okay, I think we're good. And yeet for the street. Let's go. Way. And that, that big old tail is coming around. Okay, so I'm still on a call, but I'm on hold, so we're going to finish this up here. I'll put that out to music or something. You know how it is when the phone happens and you're in the middle of doing something, but hey, we did. I got to compress the time on this. I'll cut some stuff out. We'll do something. Editing. Editing is a thing. And on that note, folks, I like the way it came out. It's a good looking car. And this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.